Now here in Search Console, if I want to remove some URLs from a domain, I can go to Google Index and there's remove URLs is under that menu item. If you go to create a new removal request, you have to put in one URL at a time. Now a couple of years ago, someone put together a Chrome extension that's still available, at least up on GitHub. The way you install it is to go down here in the bottom right under download zip, then extract the file. Once you've downloaded the file and you know where it is, go to the settings menu, then to the extensions link on the left, Check the box right here in the top right that says developer mode and you'll have the ability to load unpacked extension and then you browse to the right directory and hit OK. At that point it'll say it's OK and then you just check, check make sure that's checked. I'm going to leave it unchecked for the moment because I'll show you how to turn it on once you have it. Now to use it in Google Webmaster Tools, once you already have it installed, go to settings on your extensions tab, turn it on by checking the box and when you refresh here in Webmaster Tools, then you all of a sudden have a box here and you can upload your file. In this case, I'm just going to choose the right document. And almost immediately, the page just simply starts to flash. And you can see that it's going over and over and over, removing, doing all the removal URLs. I typically, if I'm doing a lot like I am right now, I'll typically move this tab over out of the way and let it run. And you can see every once in a while, if a request has already been made, it'll, it'll pop up with a red message there like that one says, oop, you already did this one. The neat thing about this is that it's an open source extension at GitHub, so I'll give you the link here and then down here in the right bottom right corner you just download zip. That's it. Have an optimal day.